So you guys have to check out this entire video to see this Babyliss Pro Titanium Flat Iron dupe. It is amazing. I got my money on you. Big face is breaking brand new. While it's here, this is what you need to do. Come and get this flat iron. Hey everyone, it's Beetlejuice again. I'm just kidding. So first, I'm starting off with the conditioner that is in my hair. I've let it sit for about 30 minutes because my hair is slightly damaged at the top. Well, it's very damaged at the top because of just the way that I've been wearing my ponytails, really trifling during the season. So I've had some breakage. So these are the products. Let's start here. This is the Mazzani Moisture Fusion Silk Cream Conditioner. This is a must. It's only like maybe 12 to $15, but this is the must product for silk presses and then also the Brazilian keratin therapy conditioner which is only like six dollars from organics but I just think both of these products together are amazing it guarantees a good silk press product is key also I've been using this detangler brush this is actually a Denman brush because the bristles are just flat there aren't any like those balls that pretty much tug your hair like this one has but if you have that it'll do but let me show you the truth okay now you see this real curl pattern at first, if you rewind the video, I had all these nice curls, but no, my true hair pattern is like 4B, 4C-ish, something like that. Okay, this is definitely kinky, la negra hair. La negra, negro, okay? Negro. <laughs> and I'm proud of it. However, today we're here for a silk press, amen? Alright, so I'm starting with just sectioning my hair. This is the key to getting your hair done at home in a proper way I'm telling you because you will be upset at the end so I'm starting with the bio silk since I have rinsed the product out my hair is completely rinsed of the conditioners so I'm just putting the bio silk conditioner in. it's not a conditioner it's more like a serum but it's like a leave-in and it acts as a two-in-one so it keeps your hair it keeps your hair silky and it also provides heat heat protection so this is the Paul mini skinny wait I'm sorry Paul Mitchell skinny serum this stuff right here will keep your hair silky and it really helps with the frizz I saw one of my college classmates like in 2009 wear this stuff and her hair was silky straight so I just started using it last year and I must say when I didn't do my hair with this product there was a difference it was kind of frizzy so I'm just using this to you know go ahead and put all through my hair follicles every single strand if you can but this brush I'm really enjoying it like I don't have any snags or hair loss so I would totally recommend you getting that from Dollar Tree it was from Dollar Tree yes Dollar Tree so it made this blowout much easier as well I did learn from the pros that you're supposed to um, fl not flat iron but like blow dry your hair in a downward position never upwards because that messes up your follicles or something or it splits your hair or something like that so I just always go in a downward motion and this is the key to getting a good blowout. I use the stretch tension method first and then do the blowout. And so because my hair is thinner at the top because of the breakage, it just to me looks a mess. And sometimes it's just more fragile so I have to just go slow when I'm you know, doing the top. But we're just going to pray. You know, We're going to keep using our wild growth oil and Jamaican black castor oil. And we're going to praise God and move on. Alright? Okay. So I do the same thing with each section and I do split them in smaller sections to make sure that that skinny serum and that bio silk gets down in the delta on in them roots because that's where I need my hair to be the straightest. Okay, my hair on the ends are a bit more loose in curl because of it's being basically heat trained. It's not heat damaged, it's just heat trained. I've had heat on my hair for the past two, three years, so of course the ends are going to be straighter or looser than the roots. But the roots, baby, that's what tells you what type of hair you got for real. Okay, so yeah. The Babyliss Pro Dupe. I saw it online on Amazon and it looked just like the Babyliss. Same description, titanium plates, and for an affordable price. And then you can use my discount code in the description box to save you a little coin. Let me find out. Okay, fancy. 
see. So this is from Kiposi or Kiposi Salon Tools. Look at this. Got the little bougie box. Okay, come on. I'm excited because this is what you pay $100 for, you know, when you get the baby lift. So, yeah. So I decided to get the two inch because look at these plates. I feel like they look the same. So it has recommendations. For damaged hair, only use up to 350. My hair is slightly damaged at the top, but we don't care. For healthy hair, 410. Fragile, 270. We're gonna do 370. No, we're actually gonna do 380. It says for healthy, 350 as well. I mean, 390. So, it just, it's so cool. It just, it'll show you, you know, what you should be, what setting you should use it on. If you guys can kind of see that. I think that's so neat. That's so neat, but I'm gonna bug the system. You guys know I'm trying to get good results. So I also go through every section and use this because I'm scared and I don't want heat damage. All right, now let's, let's, let's go ahead and do it. Oh. Oh, oh, okay, okay. This is the, now every section is going to have a little smoke because of the product on it. So it's not this, trust me, it's not even smoking. It's not smoking at all and it's at 390 degrees. So I just wanted to clarify that. And I do the comb chase method. Oh, ew. Oh, now this is silky. Girl, it was silky. I was so scared to get my roots, but this is silky. We gonna, we gonna keep going. We might, I'm gonna go ahead and do 400. I'm gonna do 400. I'm gonna try 400. Let's get these roots up. Ooh, kinda scared now. All right, now that's better. All right, now that's it. That's it. We gonna leave that alone. We gonna praise God and move on. Okay. Ooh. I still messed it up. Still messed up the rotation. Which? Oh my goodness, girl. That now that is something. Ooh. That's all I needed. That's all she did what she needed to do. Okay. We are not a monolith. Black girls can wear our hair curly and straight. Girl. 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 All right, come on, Saints. Let's get it together. Get it together. One pass, girl, one pass. This is it. These people, girl. This is it, honey. Ew. Do it all so silky smooth. Just let it shine. Every time I sing this song on a video, you all know. This is the Baby List Junior, for facts. Facts. Educational facts. This is it. Irrefutable facts. Here we go. Yeah. Did you, look, look at that. Look at that. Just. He just. Just. Oh, yes. Yes. This is it, honey. This is it. This is it. Ooh.
mean? Did you say something, girl? Okay, let's not. Okay, so this is the semi-finished product. This is just if I had left it straight before adding some uh, clip-ins. This is not any clip-ins right now. I'm just, you know, my hair. But the front, like I said, the front right side is so much thinner. So I'm just showing you guys what the silk press did. It is very, very silky. I'm very happy that I chose this flat iron. This is totally the Babyliss Pro dupe. And off camera, I did clip my ends. So that's why, you know, they look clipped. <laughs> I just clipped them a little bit, but yeah. So we'll have to just check in next time for the hair growth update. So I did curl the hair because I did not know how to do the flat iron curls on my own hair. It's just hard to do it on your own hair like the salons do. So I just wrapped it and then I put my bonnet on but I put some plastic pieces under it because I didn't even have any plastic wrap. So I kind of rigged it. So this is just how I got these body curls and I added some body to my hair. And then I guess to make it even fuller I can just always wear clip-ins. And so my goal now is to just get it to be thicker. So I probably will do some more protective styles and maybe some straight hairstyles. So comment below if you want to see some natural hairstyles. And please give this video a thumbs up and share to your Facebook, Twitter, especially Instagram and wherever to get this video out because this flat iron is worth it. Thank you guys for watching and see you guys in my next video.